I'm an artist. People don't understand that about me. They have all these ideas of who I am, and I'm kind of like a uh, specter. I am a screen for projections, really. But when a situation like this occurs, and I'm face to face with someone who's causing me trouble, I like to reveal a little bit about myself. Other people can augment my name, turn me into a legend, and that's fine. It's a little bit gratifying, but this conversation with you is the most gratifying because this is, this is where we create art together. You're my canvas. Because what I'm doing is giving you these different colors, these different brush strokes and themes, and then you get a choice. I'm telling you that you have a choice, that you have a secret. You have a secret. And that means you're very important to me. Now, you could accidentally dis... But that's not really any fun, is it? There's no art in that. That's brutal. An assassination is easy when you've got a pack of Dobermans. You know what I mean? Like, it's art to have a pack of Dobermans and not use them. Because there's always the implication that they could be used. And then that just narrows the focus of the field of possibility between you and I. You know, <laughs> I mean, look at them. They're perfect for getting the job done. They almost, they're almost salivating. You're a boner for them. But that's not art. That's not Picasso. How am I Picasso if I set the Dobermans loose, you know? You've got a secret that can take me down. You're a figurehead in the community. You're important. You could sink me. But you know that you've always got the Dobermans on your trail. And they would snuff you in a second, but I don't want to do that. That's, that's the masterpiece there. The masterpiece is you're alive. You're powerful. Every day, you're there and you're thinking to yourself, how can I prove my value to me? And I know that. I know that's what you're going to go through from now on. As long as you choose to live, as long as we have this implicit pact between us that when you leave this room your life is going to be dedicated to creating value for me in the community it will be invisible but fulfilling other people aren't going to understand the mural that you and I are painting together and this is the consequence because now you're indentured to me for life to co-create a masterpiece with me. You didn't know who you were fucking with when you extorted that secret from her. You had no idea. You were in your own world, in your own reality, without understanding that there's a much more powerful parallel reality that you stumbled into, my brother. And now your life is going to be art. Before it was simply domination, coercion. You were the predator. You were the apex predator in your reality until you enter my reality. And now we're going to establish a rapport. Because I do not believe that it's in my best interest or in your best interest for you to vanish. I believe 
that it is in your best interest to become art. After all, that is what I am. I believe it is in your best interest to be my apprentice. Because what you don't understand quite yet, but perhaps one day you will understand it, is that when you become art, you become fulfilled. It's really that simple. Your predatory ways weren't artistic, were they? It was just extortion. There's no agreement there. <laughs> Yes, yeah, I know, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, oh, here he is with a pack of Dobermans ready to eat me alive. That, that's extortion, isn't it? You've got my secret, man. You could end it for me like that. So that's why I've got the Dobermans here. We're pretty much neutral. If I don't have the Dobermans... I don't have anything on you, do I? We're not level. So it's, it's really up to you to figure out how your life is going to become art in service to this art. <laughs>